But the biggest challenge was flying at night. Were they ready? Manuel touchdown. Yes, said Picard, and he announced to the team that Andre would be in the cockpit. No, Andre will stay up there now as long as we can. And off he went into the night. For eight hours, Andre flew in darkness over Switzerland. Andre could see nothing, so the team on the ground had to track winds, squalls, battery levels. Watching this creature in the air, long after the sun has surrendered, is almost unreal. The plane emerges from the darkness like an apparition. Just before the sun peeked through the clouds, Bertrand counted Andre down to the dawn. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go! We made it, guys! Andre, you should be with us right now. Andre made it with power to spare. And just think, he could have taken off again without refueling. It must be a pretty good sensation when that sun comes up in the morning. Uh, it is, well, it is certainly because of the beauty. I mean, the sunset is gorgeous, but the sunrise, of course, brings the next day there. It brings the hope again that you can continue.